So let's take a look at this via building mode, shall we? Why am I not moving so fast? Whatever. We've got the unassuming park right here. Then we've got some very oddly placed lights along with an ominous glass staircase. I do not understand why I'm this slow. I also think I did not get the uh, doors. Uh, that's a problem for the lower areas. So we got fake door, um, fake bookshelves here as the doors. Um, that'll come in handy. This, oops, this is the entertainment district now for the new area. We've got a nice little large pool. With all these um, pool tables. We've got a nice little like production area for like sketch artists or whatever. Um, and a whole bunch of like production stuff. We've got a gaming section with a whole bunch of gaming computers and stuff like that. Um, we also got an easel here for like the art and stuff. Nice little barbecue grill chess and for people who want to watch it's too nice here also we got the main centerpiece the stage but it's too nice here is probably what you're thinking I got something on my sleeve don't I well you would be correct because the first thing you may be wondering is why are there so many um, hoods why are there so many microwaves why are there so many goddamn sinks also, what's up with this? these just stoves that are also unaccessible? That is because of the fact that we're going to taunt them with the ability to have a better quality item, but they're stuck using the crappy stuff here. So now we've got the worst quality stuff here. Also, a single, a singular pink refrigerator. Some say it might catch things on fire. Um, that is it for this area. <laughs> Some, I'm having a struggle here. Somehow, this will catch on fire. I'm calling you right now. Now, you may be wondering, why are there bathroom, why is there a whole bunch of stalls in my bushes area? That's because we have a little hedge maze to get to the bathrooms. I do not know why, but there are, oops. Now, I'm not entirely sure why, but there's bushes here that just did not show up. We kept the rainbow doors, although it's a guessing game now. Each one of these has a literal toddler potty, and we also got a singular sink in the corner here. An excessive amount of mirrors. And by the way, those are not improperly labeled. You'll s soon find out what those are. We've got the god, we've got the council here just <coughs> sitting behind the bathtub. We also, I also forgot to mention, this entire area is carpeted. Carpeted kitchen, carpeted bathroom, carpeted bottom of the pool. I commit war crimes and I do not feel bad for them, about doing them. Now in each and every room we have another guessing game. Flowers or bathtub? Flowers or bathtub? That's a flower. That's a flower. And then we got this very crappy bathtub. A singular crappy bathtub. And then more flowers. More flowers. Um, now the best part. My favorite part. I've, I had a feeling people were going to be complaining about the sheer amount of, like, lighting. So I made sure that, uh, we didn't have to worry about flooding the entire, like, bedrooms with uh, lights and yes you heard that right these are all bedrooms let's take a look inside them shall we that's the exact same thing they have to go through this obnoxiously long hallway with three lights and then they have this tiny little bed and a clock now you'll notice this is the same for every single one of these little doors here it is the exact same 
That is the best part about this. Now you may be wondering why the hell are there so many curtains here? Why is there stone bricks here? Oh wait, I also forgot to mention the best part about this too. Metal flooring instead of like the carpet like everywhere else. Anyways. Yeah, I didn't add the doors here yet. I should. I'm going to add that later. Now you may be wondering why there's just a large empty room. Is it laziness or is this actually just ingenious ways to make people walk like five miles over? We basically got these really uncomfortable benches, a fireplace right next to some curtains, which is not even a bad idea at all. I don't know why you'd think it's a bad idea. And we got kids' televisions. Now, might wait. I'm pretty sure I already saw it, but my favorite section of all, Alcoholism City. I did not light this place up yet, but in front of you is bars and thousands upon thousands of bar stools this place will create alcoholism and misery and I do not feel ashamed for it this is worth one million dollars dude I could literally get I'm getting the idea here though that I will create for season three, if I do a season three, I will probably create like a, I don't know, maybe like a nightclub and then do the exact same thing but with random strangers, possibly going in as well with like the park. Basically though, it's just going to be a whole bunch of anarchy, but also a whole bunch of fun. I'll have a nice little nightclub all set up for people, but it won't matter because they'll end up probably getting just trapped in my wonderful little area there we don't need um doors there okay that is it though for the tour so thank you for watching